High school sports in New York have been allowed to return to action, even those deemed high risk like basketball. It's a move applauded by players and parents alike. And here's CBS 2's Steve Overmeyer. Let's compete. Ready? Go. Let's go. Come on. There's an electricity in this gym. Hey! Archbishop Stepanak High School in White Plains is preparing for its first game in nearly a year. We haven't played basketball in about a year, so they're all like bottled up in us and like we're just unleashing it now. Safety protocols must be met. Close contact COVID-19. No. Players must wear masks even during the game, but at least they're playing. Parents have just been so excited that the school has put all these guidelines in place that it's safely done for the guys to play uh, the game they love. We know how special it is to be playing basketball in the middle of a pandemic and we're super fortunate to be here and we're just trying to have fun every day. According to a University of Wisconsin study, this year 65% of high school athletes have suffered from either depression or anxiety. The return of high school sports isn't about entertainment, it's about mental health. I don't think anybody realizes what 14 to 18 year olds have gone through. Nobody understands the, the lack of social interaction, what it's done to them. It doesn't even have to be the best brand of basketball. It's just the fact that they're able to do something together. Parents aren't allowed at practice and they won't even be able to attend the game. But that's not the point. I understand like sometimes like basketball isn't always the first priority. Sometimes you have to take care of um, other things and make sure that everything's running smoothly with the whole COVID thing. But um, now that we're back, we're just um, I'm just getting getting along together. It just makes us all happy. In a year that's given our kids a new perspective on the world around us. It also shows that life is much more than just the sport. Um, whether it's academics, focusing on something else you love, because the ball's going to stop bouncing at some point. But not yet. Not while the game still brings joy. In White Plains, Steve Obermeyer, CBS 2 News. And Step next first game is tonight against their arch rival, Iona Prep. And you can get a link to the live stream of the game on our website, cbsnewyork.com. Good luck.